everyone, welcome back to our channel. Matt and I spent a weekend camping and exploring around Mount St. Helens in Washington. If you're not familiar with Mount St. Helens, it's the volcano that erupted in May of 1980, but more on that in a little bit. We camped at Tower Rock Campground since we aren't as familiar with dispersed camping options in the area and ended up finding some really great spots we plan to come back to. We hope you enjoy this video and please subscribe if you're not already. Okay guys, here's a quick campground tour for you. Pretty simple setup here. Really bummed about the fire pit situation, but we have our gas pit, so all is not lost. Pretty excited to try out this outdoor couch. Some amazing colleagues of mine got me for my birthday recently. Oh, there's two chambers. Let's see. Oh, here goes nothing. It's just there's a big air chamber on both sides. Okay. Two air pockets. Right. And this goes through. I think this makes a big hot dog bun. Start blowing. <laughs> oh, that's going in the blue face. Yeah. <laughs>
On the morning of May 18, 1980, the largest landslide in recorded history triggered a massive eruption on Mount St. Helens. Within three minutes, the blast, traveling at more than 300 miles per hour, blew down and scorched 230 square miles of forest. Volcanic ash rose over 80,000 feet and drifted across the United States within three days and encircled the earth in 15. All right, here we go, my Stairmaster for today. That'll get the heart pumping. Only two million more to go. <laughs> I don't want stairs. This is the blast zone, the blast side of the mountain. And then this is Spirit Lake. And you can see all of that's just dead, dead trees <laughs> out there. All right, made it down. M is still on her way, carefully counting each step. <laughs> Fo focus. How many do you think? Oh my God, my legs hurt real bad. How many do you think? I said 223. And I said 350? Yeah. 428. Wow. Twice. So we've invested in some fun new gear for the GoPro and Matt's got some Iron Man stuff going on. <laughs> it's Tony Stark. You wanna, it's magnetic basically, so it's super cool. You wanna show him? Oh yeah. To infinity and beyond. Uh, that that's right Toy Story. Oh. <laughs> What's this called? Stick it. Slip, slap it? We'll put it in the slip, description. Slip, slip, slippy, slappy, Swanson. Anyway. We have uh, a few of these little magnetic guys and a few of these little magnetic guys. Well, they're the same thing. There's actually a, a necklace one too, but uh, boom. Yeah, pull the necklace one out, show them. Solid as a rock. So this is what was keeping it stuck to his chest, the Iron Man style. So yeah, it's just a magnetic thing. Oh, and just remember you do have it on because you can strangle yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Stay away from metal. <laughs> Great for picking up nails at campsites too. <laughs> so all of the dead standing trees would have been killed by the blast. And then you can see obviously where some are just blown over from the blast as well. Here's some of the itty bitty baby trees making their way back 40 years later. In 1982, Mount St. Helens National Volcanic Monument was established for all to observe both the awesome destruction and the remarkable recovery of plants and animals. Mount St. Helens is still the most active volcano in the contiguous United States. Bottom.
bottomed out on that one. We're hiking down to see a waterfall. So I might be a little bit out of shape. What do you think about this camp spot? Totally awesome. Hey guys, this is Beetlejuice and him. We're back here. <laughs> Just say Beetlejuice three times. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back. This is Beetlejuice and him. <laughs> yeah, <nothing extra>. yeah, <laughs> both. Yeah. yeah, we bottomed on that one. <laughs> okay, we're good. Uh.